Hello, my name is Drago and I am part of the Digital Asset Integration Team here in Pentagon Solutions. Today, in this video, I will show you how to use Appearance, Profiles and Noversworks. So, when we receive an work file from our consultant designers, it might show all the services as a monochrome. This brings confusion during the coordination processes. So, let's see how this Appearance tool can benefit to your BIM processes and asset management. Appearance Profile is fairly underused tool in Navasworks, but allows you to set up a custom appearance profiles based on data using search set, selection set, property values, use them to color code objects in the model, so you can differentiate system types and visually identify their status based on data. So let's see how it works. There are two ways of creating profile. It's selector by property or selector by set. Let's try the set. It set means it will read the search and selection sets that we have already in the model. If you change any of them, just refresh and it will pop up here. So let's try the level one, which will search for all the objects on level one. Again, it depends of the search set. I will use just the one that are already in the model. We can highlight, choose the, the color to highlight and change the appearance. Transparency, let's put to zero and add in the selector. Let's run it. See, now the color is changed to red. Let's try level two. Again, level two, change the color. Just to have three levels in different color out level 3 out again into the selector and run now we have the three levels all the objects color coded by the search set based on the data in the model so let's try selector by property by property means it will read the properties in the model Let's say we went to color code uh, flex duct, which means we need to type the category element. A property will be category, and it will be equal to the value of the category flex duct. Let's test the selection. It works. Let's put the color. And transparency 60%. Let's run. Right now, we have all the objects on level 1, 2 and 3 color coded. And we choose the properties element category and flex depth value to color code the flex depth. So how actually this can be used in reality? Appearance profile can be saved as a DAT file and shared with all the stakeholders and they can bring into Navasworks so they can have exact same color code in their models. Also using the NWF model, you can bring the new updated models from the designers consultants and run the tool to change the appearance in the model and we'll keep it constant if for any reason we need to undo the color coding and the work of the appearance profile in Navasworks you can just select the model and reset appearance and we'll go back to a monochrome so hopefully that's been informative and thanks for watching if you want to get more information you can subscribe and also can follow us on Twitter Facebook and LinkedIn.